from Schoonover Stadium on the campus of Kent State University in Kent, Ohio. It's game number 39. This afternoon, the Kent State Golden Flashes and the Central Michigan Chippewas will continue this weekend series featuring division leading clubs. 2 2. A swing and a miss. He comes back and gets strikeouts to get the final two outs of the first. Hankins pitches and it's swung on, looped out toward right field. This ball is going to drop. Not caught by Sullivan. And then stumbling around and diving safely back into first base is Cannabis after a long turn. Swung on, shot to center. Mamarella got a good jump, dives, and he makes the headlong catch in short center field. And the pitch. Swing and a miss. Fastball by him upstairs. He records his third strike. There's the set. And the payoff, swinging a long drive down the left field line. It goes, fair ball, one hop out of here. Ground rule double to start inning number two. Rosa, who was down in the count 0-2, ran it full and then rocks a leadoff double to left. Foot right on the back line. Hankins delivers, and it's swung on, line to right center. That's a base hit. The 2-2, got him. A foul tip caught by Del Porto. What a play. That was diving away and down. Now the 0-1. Swing and a liner to left. Cannabis is right there to make the catch at the belt. Ellie was playing in. And that shallow line drive is snagged by Cannabis. And how about Zach Williman? He'll try that with the top of the order as Mamarella drops a bunt down. Charging in on it, Adam. Scoops. Throw it to first on a bounce. Didn't get him. The 2-0. Lined a deep left down the line. It's another fair ball. Into the corner it goes. Birch will be waved around as it takes an odd carom. Birch coming around, he scores. And Rosa delivers a second double. And the Golden Flashes creep back to within three. Here's Hankins looking and pitching. And there's a drive into right center field. That's a gapper. It'll hit the warning track, bang up against the wall, base hit. Rosa can tiptoe home, he scores, and Yero has delivered the second double of the inning. The Golden Flashes are within two. The 2-0, -oh. double play ball to short, gobbled up by Hollander to second one, the relay, call it two on a dig by Rosa. The one, two, and it's strike three called. Frozen. Here's the payoff, runner stays, strike three called. Greenman is out looking. Two called third strikes are the outs in the seventh for Havacost. Now the pitch. A swing and a ground ball, weakly hit off a of first. Over to grab it, Kratt. He feeds to the pitcher. Somehow he's, no, he didn't get the bag. And the 3-2. A swing and a shot to center. This will get a run in. And now Gillis going back. Running, running, running. Makes the catch. Mamarella tags, he scores. And moving to third base is Luke Birch. And Del Porto does what he absolutely had to, and that is get at least a runner in. So it's a five to four game as that ball really took off on Gillis. Kratz squares around, Spangler delivers, and the bunt toward the mound, scooped, bobbled by Spangler, bare hand pick up and flip to first for the out, he didn't panic. Both these clubs are now 11 and three. Final score of this one, Central Michigan 7 and Kent State 4.